back to Darkest Dungeon. Let me plug and unplug my mic. Okay, cool. So last time, we encountered a very interesting bug. Um, apparently, there was some sort of strange issue going on with Darkest Dungeon and OBS going at the same time, and it would always crash at the very end of a mission. It's interesting to see what saves and what doesn't save at the very end of a mission before you return to town, because I could keep certain items like gold, trinkets, uh, but I couldn't get certain character things like experience and getting stress relief in town or getting weird quirks taken away in the sanitarium. So that was pretty interesting. Through that, you know, weird phase, it actually enabled us to buff up a lot of our people. So a lot of our people are as high as they can go skill-wise and blacksmith-wise, which is pretty nice. Oh my gosh, that sounds crazy calm. Like, holy crap. <laughs> that sounds amazing. But yeah, so, um... It's the same party I've been running. This is like the fourth time I think I'm trying to get Phantom up to level 3. Um, but yeah, so we're going to do this mission because I've been leveling up the wield a bit too much. So we're going to go to the Warrens again. So yeah. We're going to do it again. Same character loadout. They have really weird things. I mean, this is fantastic. The fact that she has the camping skill still active from camp from the last time we camped. Which is amazing, I love that. But we've been actually, we've been able to get a lot of money out of these missions, so let's go for it. Alright, so, this is weird because our inventory starts off crowded with pickaxes. Because we have to take down some altars. So, what do I like? I like running with 12 food, I guess? 4 shovels, because I'm paranoid? Really, Conway? I thought at one point you said you got it working again. That is a shame. I wonder why that is. Use OBS, right? Fa right, uh, Convoy? It just doesn't show up. Hmm. So this, this is why I think they should have like a Geek Squad version of Twitch. And you could just call out like a Twitch guy and be like, Hey man, can you help me out with my stuff? And then some dude in like some purple, you know, shirt with Twitch on it um, would, you know, come by your house and he'd check up your setup. Which is like in some basement. Mine's not my basement, it's my room. My room is very small, but that's okay. <laughs> it makes it makes every like living space I've been in like extra spacious. But anywho. Um I think that'd be a thing to to think of in the future. Of course I think you get prank calls all the time. <laughs> but whatever. Alright, let's embark. So you do use OBS. I can't think of what would be the issue then. I guess like I can only think of like make sure you're getting the right window when you're capturing and like I don't know. Man dressed as a wizard climbs through the window with a portable green screen and a bandana. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. That's what happens. Some dude just like pops out of freaking nowhere. You need help with your stream. Let me help. You'll show me a screenshot? Oh, okay, that'll help, actually. Oh, this room layout's the worst. Holy crap. Um... I think I want to do, like, a wind back up, and then, like... How the F do you do... Maybe, like... That'll work. Okay, so you go, like, up here, back, down, around, around, and then if it's in any of these hallways, then just... Whatever, man. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> That's a terrible layout. Ugh. But she's our stress relief, this lady, because we have so much frickin' uh, stuff. Critical damage. Damn it, we were surprised. Holy crap. Well, whatever. These guys aren't that hefty. Either. How did he get to go first? That's odd. Nice dodge. The doge. Executed that was with just enough damage. And we'll do a lunge. Be nice. gone, fiend. Damn good amount of trinkets too. Alright, you 
need to move like all the way up. And that's our party layout. Nice. Uh, torch light, how's that going for us? We could use another one. Okay. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go in this hallway for a second, just to see what this is. And I would like for someone that doesn't have, like, terrible things... Alright, Phantom, take a look at these books. Damn it, it's unsettling. Oh, it brought down our torchlight. That's, that's not a terrible, terrible thing. That's okay. And we'll head back up. So, I just wanted to go on the hallway, because I noticed there was a thing there, so... That could have been what we're looking for. It wasn't. You never know. 250 gold, alright. Okay, let's see. Alright, let me take a look. interesting. You know what I'm seeing, Convoy, is that you should you only have one scene and a whole bunch of sources. You might want to try actually having separate scenes for separate uh, stuff. So, for instance, let me show you what I'm working with right here. So, I have right? I hope this is showing for you. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Oh no! What have I done? I just wanted to- here wait, let me try that again. Uh, <laughs> that was not what I wanted to do. Uh, okay. So as you see here, I have- there we go. See, I have different scenes for everything. So this is my, my darkest dungeon, I have Fallout, ESO, so basically every game I have different things. And I just have, you know, my background stuff, the actual game itself, and then the camera, and then all my other stuff on top. So that's how I have it. But yeah, it could be that, yeah. So, that's what I do. So I can just go from that to ESO, and then ESO is ready. Um, and then that to Fallout. So, I mean, I keep the same background usually. Although, apparently I did that for Morley. That's gauntlet. But yeah, um, it, I, I don't know. I've never actually tried, you know, using um, one thing for multiples. I mean, that sounds pretty interesting, but I'm not sure how that works out. Anyway, Darkest Dungeon. Whoa! Whoops. Where'd it go? Oh, there we go. <laughs> I lost it for a second. Alright, hopefully that helps. There we go. Alright, just have it on the screen so I can check out whenever someone does a follow me. Okay, cool. We're good to go. I want this man dead. Oh, that doesn't work on him. We'll try that. <coughs> Damn it, that didn't work. Nasty slice of this. Uh, thrown dagger might kill him though. Press nice. this advantage. Give them no quarter. Mm. Should I go for a stun? Go for a stun on the er, Yeah, I'll go for a stun. Oh, I can't. Damn it. I'll go for a judgment on this guy. Nice. And then point blank shot, and we'll see what kind of damage we do. 18, that's not bad. That's not bad. Rain of whips can be nasty. Alright, two people inflicting the bleed. That's not terrible. Try. Yeah, As nice. the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. And Wicked Slice. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Click that. The bigger the beast, the greater the glory. Nice. Have an anti venom just in case. 78 is not enough. The light, the promise of safety. I mean, maybe it was. <laughs> oh, I don't have the right orientation. Anyway, I want to kill one of these guys. Like, really bad. <laughs> Hopefully, we can kill this guy. Nice. Surges as the enemy crumbles. It gives me syphilis every time. Ooh, Death that is waits. nasty, though. For the slightest lapse in okay. concentration. We need to like kick this thing's ass with a nice crit. How quickly the tide turns. 
That was exactly what I was looking for, actually. Reeling about to break. Nice dodge. That's nasty. Um Yeah, let's do this. I was expecting a little more damage, but whatever. I'll do a collect bounty on this guy, because I don't want him to attack me again. Alright. I'm going for a dazzling light. Nice. Wicked slice. And collect bounty. Nice. A trifling victory. Might be a bit more stressful, but later, a victory we'll nonetheless. Uh. Yeah. Whatever. Anti venom. Go away. I'm gonna have to do so much inventory management. Cause I have skeleton keys. Damn. It. Okay. Um. You eat that food. You eat this food. Damn it, I want these things. It didn't fix it? Oh. So this is why we need the, the Twitch guy, that, the Twitch man that climbs in through your window and helps you with your stream. Exactly why. Aha! You used this, right? Oh! It looks exactly the same. Cult Scrollings. Does anybody need it? You could do something with it, right? Can you burn it? Nope, okay. Never mind. We just wasted something. Forever change the hero. Great. Weak grip on life. That's bad. Well, no, no. I need those picks to actually complete the mission. I know it's like taking up my inventory, but it's actually what I need to complete the mission itself. A nice crow. crit. It only did stress relief for him though, which is unfortunate. Uh, melee. Why not? Oh, come on, don't give me that. Cannot be left unanswered. Oh, that was bad miss. Oh, come on, you couldn't have done one more damage. <laughs> uh, let's try this again. Nice. Redeem yourself, sir. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. There's probably a better way I could have done that, but whatever. Oh no, that's fine, I know. It's, it, every game, I just... See, what's weird is this looks exactly like the, like, thing that I'd use the pick on. Which is weird. Anywho. Check out this back room. So that could just be a cult scrawling, or it could be the thing we're looking for. It's kind of weird. The fact that he goes first is actually really annoying. I kind of want to give him a stone that lowers his speed. Um, what is that being influenced by? Quirk. Interesting. Alright, um... There's none of these guys that are too bad. I'll just finish him, because the blight is pretty nasty. And thrown dagger. Oh, didn't quite get him. I think that's her attack with the highest crit chance. That's why I try to like... I like going for that a lot. Stress relief, basically. And Dazzling Light to help us with a little bit of damage. Oh wait, I forget, when you kill him with Dazzling Light, it doesn't actually count. As victories mount, so okay, too so will Resistance. Switch him around. Good. You don't need to... Damn it. Animalistic Shrine! Nice. Uh... Sweet! You saw how I did that, right? She had the quirk that was bad, but I selected him instead. So you have like a little second to actually select someone else if you don't want her to look at things. Um, she's actually okay, so I didn't want her having a negative perk. Right, I 
don't know if anything's in here. I'll put a torch on anyway. Nothing's in here? Alright. Good to know. Got our way back. She's freaking out. Holy crap. Do you have a Warren's phobia? You have nothing. You have nothing. Holy crap. It's like female version of Convoy or something from last game who had like no negative quirks for some reason. I don't even want that thing. Okay, the next room. Nice, another torch. And some crests. Friggin' why not? Why not? Eh, whatever. You know, we're above 75 at least. I don't think I have a sun cloak or anything like that yet. Nice dodge though. Nice dodge. Uh, yeah, we'll eat. Ow, oh, that took a lot of food actually. One of you is a stress eater maybe? You're obsessed with food, that probably isn't a good thing. Hmm. Strange. You're our in God. <laughs> Alright. We won't get to get like a ton of stress relief for our next camp, but that's okay. Alright, what do we got here? Um Gimme a good flippin' critical strike. I mean it's friggin' twelve. Actually it's twelve with most of these. Most of thrown weapons, which is interesting. Kick that thing's ass. Damn it. Well, that's okay. Destroyed. Nice. Um. I want to kill that thing. A devastating blow. Yes. Nice stress relief. Judgment. Actually, no. I'm gonna go for dazzling light on this guy. The Dead, match is struck. A blazing star is born. At least he didn't do that crazy stress attack. He's debuffed. I'm not sure how much that's gonna harm us, but nice crit. Strike. Nice crit. Awesome. Look at slice. Decimated. I wasn't sure if that was gonna work or not, but it did. Excellent. Look at all these friggin' trinkets. We're going home, rich boys. Um, sometimes this cures people of quirks. I would really like to cure this guy of a quirk, if I can. Or, you know, he's just deeply disturbed. I always like to look at the positive side, right? <laughs> Alright, head on down. Probably gonna need some uh, some stress relief in town. You know, assuming that all this works out. <laughs> uh, but there has been an update, so I am hopeful. Okay, so I want this guy dead. We're going to. I mean, they're surprised, so we get like a free turn, basically. Um, extra damage on him. Point blank shot. Nice. Nice dodge. Nice dodge. Alright, collect bounty. Your prodigious kill. size alone does not dissuade nice. the sharpened blade. A lunge, I think. Leap forward. Ooh, baby. Baby. Well struck. I always find it weird that uh, sometimes one person gets stress relief in your party, but not all of them. I think that's like there's like some weird religious faction basically that they have. Oh wait, I wanted to um wait, I just want to go to camera. I always wanted to do this but never did. I kinda like it if it looked like I was stressed out, like I have that little stressed out thing on me. Yeah, there we go. 
That's pretty sweet. Yeah. Oh no, I got stress! Ding! <laughs> Anywho, um, I just wanted to change that. So yeah. Um, yeah, let's open this chest. With a skeleton key! Unlocks in compartment. Finding the stuff is only the first More test. Items. Now it must be carried home. Okay. Keep going. We have like a fight right here. It's maggots, so whatever. And they're surprised maggots. The best kind. Um. Oh, good lord, give me that crit. What else do we have? Thrown dagger? Yeah. Throw your dagger at some measly maggots. And point blank shot! Because overkill. <laughs> Which is why not? This expedition Just at least why not. promises success. I'm glad there isn't a mana mechanic in this game, that's actually really helpful. A map is inside. Yeah, that's the whole map explored, that's awesome. Okay, so we know the rest of the rooms are- Wow, we won't actually encounter a single fight for the rest of this uh, mission. I'm thinking we do a circle around here, visit that room, and then go up here. Because any of these could be it, so let's just head down this way. That's too funny. That is too funny. We're not going to fight anything for the rest of this mission. Yeah, sure, investigate the bone pile. I can't stop you. Well, I mean, I can, but whatever. More food, that's good. And... Yay, animalistic shrine. I'll keep going, though, for any extra loot we find, I think. Cool. I mean, we have a few things to check out. Trap, I should have decided that. But Ambushed by foul invention. Uh, you want to check this out too? No, nothing of interest. All right. Um, after Darkest Dungeon, it's uh, Fallout 3. I actually changed my schedule up because, you know, I like this game, but you know, it, it, you know, after a while, it does kind of get repetitive. So, I like to, you know, freshen it up a bit. You know do it for like an hour and then an hour the next day. Um, actually, who do I want to read this book? Do I want him to read the- you know what? Let's have you read the book. Okay. Bad humor, that's really bad. I feel sorry for this team, I've basically just been loading up bad quirks on them because I've taken them essentially for four missions. <laughs> Which is unheard of, but whatever. Um, I'm not even gonna look at that. And then we'll check out what's this last thing up here. Whatever that chest is. Oh, it's a torch. We're done. But we should have some stuff at least. Not as much treasure as we usually get, but man did we get a lot of heirlooms this time. Holy crap. Like, I think that's doubling my heirlooms that I have, like, currently. <laughs> it's pretty freaking wild. Alright, cross your fingers. This is the fourth time that you've hit lo level three. I hope it sticks. Alright. He gets the yips. That's really bad. Morton's Adventure. That's fine. Egomania. Um, whatever. Um, nice. Nice. Morton's Tactician. Uh, that's not too good. Hard noggin's okay. And steady! That's nice. What is... Is my joke hair coming? Oh! Thank you! My hair just sort of goes this way. Arrest 6 craft. <laughs> yeah, it just sort of goes this way. I mean, my hair, like, is actually curly, so I kind of have to do something with it. <laughs> So yeah, he didn't crash! Uh, let's see, lost 500 gold after becoming tipsy and buying around for the house, okay. Uh, so recovered some stress, nice, recovered more stress, relieved treatment, awesome. We 
actually got there. Alright, so phantoms, part of this group, although I can't really take them on the next mission legitimately. Um, man, I do have some people that really need stress relief. What? Are you like on some sort of mission or something? Let me check that again. Yeah, okay, one on a vision quest. You know, because, you know, someone goes on a mission quest randomly. Um, okay. That dude needs stress relief somewhere. I think the Abbey's the cheapest right now? Yeah? Um, he probably needs some stress relief, and so does Phantom, actually. Oh, I'll have to take a look at that later. Uh, let's see. Yeah, Phantom's gonna need some stress relief. Go here. And... We'll get this dude some stress relief. And the rest of these guys, it's a bit risky taking these guys out, but at this point it's fine. Um, let's see if I can upgrade anything. Blacksmith? You can make things cheaper. That's always Stand good. the flames. Mold the metal. We are raising an army. <laughs> Despite his name, yes, Convoy is actually trustworthy. <laughs> uh, let's see. And anything I can do in the guild? Yes. Okay, I made things a bit cheaper in both. Awesome. Um, oh yeah, I can't upgrade Phantom. That's fine. Stagecoach? Anybody cool I can bring along? I could use another Hellion. I only have one. I think we'll do another Hellion. And, um, shocker and weak grip on life. That's really bad. I'm gonna pass. Uh, <laughs> you know what I'm gonna do is is we'll get rid of this guy. I remember we were talking about that earlier because lepers really aren't that great, honestly. Like Crusaders are way better, so we're just gonna get rid of that guy. Make some more room. Uh, this dude is compulsive and no, so I don't want to even bother with that. Alright, let's get rid of some nasty things, shall we? Uh, the core is fine. Uh, I'll have to take care of that eventually. Uh, I'll have to take care of some of that. Um, Phantom's already in there. But there's the Luminaire. We'll have to fix that at some point. Uh, the Yips is a bad one. We don't want some dude with a gun to have the Yips. Um... Actually, I think everybody that I wanted to do is in stress relief right now. So, why don't we... Ooh, let's get rid of, rid of Compulsive. Uh, let's get rid of Compulsive, because I hate that kind of stuff. And Bad Humors, that's another good one to get rid of. Although, you know what? Now that I'm looking at it... I won't really have... I mean, we could do a level 3 mission. Yeah, we could do a level 3 mission, that's fine. So we'll just get rid of the bad humors. We'll go on a level 3 mission, that's fine. So apparently, the only level 3 mission we have available to us are all boss battles. In which case, I would be rolling something akin to... Oh gosh, that's terrible. I don't want that party layout. I want, like, Phantom in there and Convoy working together with some synergies. It's tough. I need, like, a good third man in there. But I have gotten rid of all my healers, so this is a little strange. Um, I'm trying to think what does what... Bring convoy. That that would work. He's he's an all right third man in the party. Can do some vulnerability hexes. Bring down the dodge of whatever we're doing. Um. Although you know what, I think the weakening curse is going to be better against a boss. So I might want to get rid of this artillery. In this case, we're going to get rid of Vulnerability Hex, I think. We're going to go for Weakening Curse. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, you have no bad quirks this time. It's pretty wild that, that both times you ended up like that. Um, okay, let me get a good trinket layout. Yeah, negative quirks, that is. Um, okay, so she has her Hellion's Hairpin. That's good. Okay, let's get some of these trinkets back from our party before. Uh, let's see. This... Yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, I've 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 had some different issues with lighting and stuff like that at Riskcraft. I know what you mean. Yeah, like the fact that my hair is green. Yeah, basically what it is is uh, yeah. Some days it is better. I just have better lighting in my room. Um, but yeah, essentially I need like a light above me, like going down. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> that is a that is a problem in my stream. <laughs> the lighting features. And what do I have here? Right, it looks like those are all the trinkets I was going with, I guess. I'm surprised. I thought I had some more. Whatever. Maybe it was... Hmm. Oh, apparently that was the trinkets we were working with. Alright, so let's work on our team right now. Let's see. Who would be really good to have a crit with? Actually, who are we going to fight? If we're going to fight anybody, who are we going to fight? The Necromancer would be interesting. Although I'd have to take care of some higher level skeletons, which I'm not sure I'm ready to do yet. Should we go a no healer run? Actually, we really can't, because I've taken out all my lower level people. Weird. Oh, nice. Awesome. Very cool combo. Very cool. Um, gosh, what should I go for? We should just go for the Swine King. I think he's, like, the most straightforward. Basically, you just have to deal a ton of damage to him. Killing Wilbur is a bad idea. Uh, but I think it's just the best thing we can do, really. In which case, I'm actually going to get rid of Abyssal Artillery and use the other Weakening Curse, and then maybe we could double curse him or something. I don't know if that's a thing we can actually do, but we can try it. Alright, so, let's see, trinket-wise, um, I like my healer having a trinket of speed, um, I wish it was easier to cycle between these people, but, oh, I guess I could do it over. Let's see, accuracy stones, no, maybe a speed stone would be good here. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Keep doing this well. Uh, let's see. And what does this get rid of? One speed, one crit. I could use some crits with her, actually. That'd be really fantastic. Or I could do this. What's her dodge? Yeah, let's do this. Increase her melee damage. Well... It, it's with only melee, okay, so it doesn't show her damage immediately. It just shows it with this, gotcha. That's fine, that's fine. And then we'll increase the crit with uh, this dude. Yes. Anything else I want to put on here? Accuracy minus dodge. Wow, that's incredible. Um, bleed skills, stun chance. I think we're good there. Yeah, I think we're good. Yep. All right, let me just check their skills to make sure they're okay. Yeah, he's good. She's got everything I'd want anyway. I think we're good. Let's provision. I'm scared, but we're gonna do this. I'm gonna bring a little bit more food than I usually do. Three shovels is fine. Four was just a weird thing that happened once, and I get paranoid. Um, yes. Yeah, we'll go with this. My first attempts at summoning were crude, and the results disappointing. I soon found, however, that the type and condition of the host's meat was a critical factor. 
the best results came from pigs, whose flesh is most like that of man. I'm scared. <laughs> I'll just admit that I'm scared. Alright, let's see. Um, if he's gonna be anywhere in this entire place, it's gonna probably be way over there, so that's fine. Alright, what do we got? Here? Pack contains loot. More food! More torches! A good way to start, I guess. Holy crap. Uh, how's our torch light? Yeah, it's above 75. That's fine. The vomit. Wonderful. Point blank shot. That is damn good damage. Nice dodge. Can we do a good stun on anybody? No, I think we're just gonna go for a judgment. It's four to eight. Apparently it's five to ten on that guy. Let's try to weaken this guy. Cool combo. I think it helps, at least. Ooh, stun, that's a good stun. We're gonna try... We're gonna do a breakthrough, actually, because he's pretty much down, and let's just do damage to these guys as well. Confidence surges as the enemy she gets crumbles. a debuff, which is pretty nasty, but whatever. Actually, the debuff is equivalent to if I took her trinkets off, which is pretty wild. Um, can I kill this guy? Yes. Uh, Give them no quarter. Do a little bit of damage to everybody. We're good healing-wise, actually, so let's just go for a judgment. Whatever. As long as they don't get anything bad, I'm fine. Although they keep targeting you, Convoy, for some reason. Uh, kill this thing. Oh, damn, Convoy bringing out the big guns. Faint hope blossoms. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Wicked hack. Oh! Blow. Damn. Shalamazam. As victories mount, so too will resistance. A torch. <laughs> Alright, we have like so many torches. Treasure in this room, I'm going for it. Um, damn, son. Um, let's see. 50 trap disarm, 50 trap disarm, 40 trap disarm. I would not expect that, but that's fine. Alright. Damn it. Ambushed by oh, foul invention. Um. You're an occultist. Check it out. Convoy, you are some sick son of a bitch. That is like the best thing I would want on an occultist. <laughs> Basically your speed the first turn is friggin 12, which is probably the most speed that you have like of all my characters. Um, which is awesome because that means right off the bat I could just mark something so that my bounty hunter can come second to do whatever. So congrats on that. <laughs> Holy shit. Um, Alright, let's use a torch. took a little bit. I'm surprised he actually went at all. Um, I kind of want to kill this thing because holy shit. Please no. Just stress. Um, I want to do... I want to do a weakening curse on this guy, the swine tar. Nice convoy, holy shit. Nice! I brought down his accuracy with that. Oh, actually, that didn't even work. That's whatever. Um, how much is that? That's four. How good are the stuns? No, the stuns are not good today. Let's do a little bit of damage to you. And by a little bit, I actually do mean a little bit. Can't knock her back any further, so the worst you can do is stun. 
gonna do Iron Swan to hopefully kill this thing. Damn it. I want to kill that thing so bad. Oh, why? In a single Just strike. why? Damn you, little piggy. Damn you. A piggy every time. Um. It does one to two. Yeah, okay. Just checking. Damn it. This, this is going to turn out to be nasty for me to tell. Yeah, it's going to be pretty nasty. Please kill the damn thing. Thank you. Okay, we're going to have to heal some people. Now. If it bleeds... Nice. Now let's also get another heal, actually. Eh, that's not fantastic, but it's okay. More damage on the Hulk and Swarm Tar. Ooh, that is nasty. Holy shit. Um. Don't stun her again, please. Oh my god. There we go, Steven's dead. We're probably gonna have to camp here, actually. As sad as that is. Um. I kinda wanna do Weakening Curse, actually. Oh, and you know what? We should, we should definitely heal people. Let's heal you for nothing. Um, look at slides. This is actually the first level 3 mission I'm going on. So that's not cool. Um, let's try this again. 12 is damn good. 12 is damn good. Uh, we're gonna do Divine Comfort. Heal everybody a bit. We can hack. Nice. A singular strike. Okay, we might actually be able to go a little bit further without needing camping, hopefully. Hopefully we can use camping and all the skills can be, you know, buff-wise. But we'll see. We'll camp here definitely. Oh, shit. That's awful. Um Will this do anything? Uh, it'll hurt everybody a little bit, which I'm okay with. I want to try to kill that thing. Nice. I gotta move her back, because she can't do anything in that position, and break through, because why not? Hurt both of them a little more. Trying to doom is nasty. No, I got. I gotta move her forward. I can't just keep doing breakthrough. That's annoying. Well, nice struck. crit. This expedition at least promises success. Okay, let me move people where they're supposed to be. Yeah, this next this next place we're gonna heal definitely. Um, read a scroll. Ooh, a well-rendered map. That showed me nothing. <laughs> okay then. One. Okay, we're gonna camp. I wish you could go like camping. feast, and then you could go like smorgasbord and like some other crazy crap. Okay, we want clean guns. We want sharpened spear. Unspeakable calm you, and that would actually help out a lot with the healing. I like that. And we could bless someone as well. I like that. Let's bless. It was gonna be like pretty much our main melee person, so. Bless you. 
Oh, thanks for the follow, uh, chatty one zero one, uh, zero one zero one. <laughs> thanks. All right, so she's got crit, accuracy, and dodge. Awesome. Maybe I should have put on this guy, but you know, it's too late now. <laughs> uh, we could do some stress relief, more stress relief. We could do some wound care that would help. Um, let's do some wound care on this guy. Hopefully we don't get attacked in the morning. Fingers crossed. Please, please no. I just wanna... Yes! In Radiance, may All we right. find victory. If this is the Swine King, then holy crap. Pack contains loot. The pack contains the very thing that can kill the pig, you know, the pig swine. Mechanical hazards possessed by well, evil intent. Here we are. We're not as healed up as a. Oh, you know what? Friggin' let's just eat food. Why not? We have like tons of it. That works. That totally works. All right. I don't know what's gonna happen. Weakening curse. He resisted the debuff. He's targeted that lady. Point blank shot. Yeah! Baby! That's what I was hoping for! Ah! Oh, and let's just stack if it bleeds. Oh my gosh, yes. Let's do it. <laughs> We're gonna stack it and he'll get so much damage it'll be ridiculous. Um friggin' No, let's do judgment. Screw this guy. We could have done a party heal, but screw it. This dude's gonna freaking die. And these two. So this is just marking attacks that'll actually do more damage to us. Weakening curse. Damn it! Your debuff resist is not that good. Why do you do this? Healer up again. If it bleeds, stack that bleed up. Yes, yeah, six damage per round. Holy crap. Ooh, that is nasty. That is real and nasty. The true chest. Um, Hold fast or expire. Actually, he does. Doesn't he do more range damage? based on the camping skill. I think he does more range damage, so I want to go pistol shot, actually. Never mind. <laughs> wow. Life wasted in the pursuit he killed of him with death blow. Gold. What's hilarious is if we go to the graveyard, it's going to say he was killed by Wilbur. Well, shit. So much for that. Um, we'll have to bring someone else up into our third party. I think we can actually kill this dude. I really do. Um, we can curse. Finally, the debuff worked. Um, we gotta heal this lady up. I mean, we freaking have, like, basically two healers. It's a shame that we basically took him out in one hit. Was that Bakora? Oh my gosh, see how awful that is that he gets friggin' crits all the time? And friggin' Wilbur's just gonna come in and friggin' take the hit or something. I don't know. Please no. Fuck my life. The soil. Are you fucking serious? The evil therein. It's all you, convoy! <laughs> uh, oh my gosh, she can only party heal in this position. I think now's when we actually just leave. Yeah, I don't think... Let's just attack him once, just to see what we're up against. You crit for 18. 3 damage per round. How much health does he have? Oh my gosh, convoy. You're going to kill the Swine King. You, my friend, are going to kill the Swine King. 
I can't even fucking believe it. The thing is even more horrible than death. <laughs> like my passion cannot come soon oh enough. Oh my gosh. We lost really good trinkets. We lost a lot of good people that day. But holy shit. Oh, they're both stuck. No, thank you. This is ridiculous. Is all he does is squeal? Are you fucking serious? Oh my shit. I won't let you die to Wilbur. I'm just letting you know. Um. Hopefully not. Hopefully not. I mean, it's a nasty attack he's doing, actually. It's a very nasty attack that basically just is an area effect stun. I mean, holy shit, really. This is the worst thing ever. Wilbur is, is terrible. He's a terrible piggy. Fuck off, Wilbur. Get some creativity, will you? Convoy, kill this man. Pig. Pig man. Pig bastard. Kill it! Yes! Holy Remind shit! Yourself, oh hey, we got the hell Oh, you know Jesus what? It looks like we actually get the killer. stones back from the people that died. I didn't know that was a feature. That's awesome! I thought I lost those trinkets forever. I mean, we lost, you know, the combined experience of having someone be level 3 and, you know, all that, you know, investment into blacksmithing, you know, and skill upgrades. But at least I get to keep the trinkets. I don't even use jesters, but I feel like critical dice would actually be useful. So, fuck that. Take that. I don't have another skeleton key, but we'll open this heirloom chest anyway. Packs laden that. with loot are often low on supplies. Oh, a moon ring. I will get rid of my shovel. And my torches. I can't friggin' believe it. I just can't friggin' believe it. I thought we were gonna be done there, but yeah. That will it bleed actually helped us out so that convoy could get the kill there. But that is actually two kills for Wilbur, which is wild. Alright. Fast healer. Alright, cool. Yep, Bakora died. I'm sorry, Bakora, you're gonna have to have Bakora version 2. Oh gosh. I can't even believe it. I just. I just don't even know. In truth, I cannot tell how much time has passed since I sent that letter. Fuck off, bosser. Why would you friggin' lose that? Actually, it's not that great, to be honest. Is that minus eight damage twice? That's freaking awful. I'm okay with losing that, then. <laughs> Got her bad humors and compulsive, though, that's nice. Um, so yeah, we lost a lot of level three people there, which is nasty. But Convoy survived, and he alone killed the, uh... I mean, along with, um... This lady. Killed, uh... I can't even, I don't even know anymore. At least these two are level 3, that's what I was, you know, hoping for the whole time. So yeah, we're gonna need, like, a Hellion, and who else did we lose? And a Hunter, dude. Highwayman. Let's see what we have in the stagecoach. We have a Hellion, who's soft and mercurial. That's nasty, actually. A tactician, but honestly, like, yeah, I'm not, I'm not, 
taken on that. Um, I could probably use, yeah, actually he's going to hit level 3 in any moment, so I might as well get one of these dudes. Uh, let's see, either him or... That's awful. He's not allowed to visit the brothel slugger. More melee damage. But melee skills? Eh, that might actually be okay. Um, otherwise, what skills does he have? I might stick with that guy, because that's a better quirk, as long as I can keep light above 75. I think I'll go for him. Even though, like, I'm not exactly taken by everything else, but that's fine. So it looks like we're taking this dude. Elusive. Evasive. And why don't Persistent. we rename this guy Bacor? Righteous traits two. for a rogue. Gosh, I'm gonna spell it friggin' wrong. There's another thing in it, isn't it? I'm just gonna put version 2, or V2, 2, not 3, and then I'll see what how to spell it. So, yeah, in the graveyard, we lost Bakora. Ah, oh, it's with a K, that's why. And Romdel, who were both slayed by. met their end against a Wilbur, and was slain by a vile Wilbur. Friggin, friggin' Wilbur. Um, oh, so yes, it's okay. Awesome. Cool. What do I want to do now? Actually, everybody's good stress-wise. <laughs> Surprisingly, for, you know, having, like, their party absolutely destroyed, their stress is okay. Oh, yeah, Bacora 306. I forgot about the numbers. Do -do 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 -do. Luckily, if you have as like an obscure name as me, you don't need numbers after it. It's kind of nice. Um, occasionally, things will force you to, which is weird. Uh, but yes. So it looks like next time we'll try to get these guys to level three. Maybe another level three healer going on. It's kind of weird because we're actually going to be making like two separate teams basically, because one's going to be like the upper level team, but we got to make sure that the lower level team also has a healer. And it's nasty, because you kind of want to use a healer in every team, don't you? I'm going to have to recruit another healer, and it's fine, too. Alright, Sanitarium. We need to cure people of random crap. Uh, I don't like all of those. we got to get rid of at least something. Let's get rid of this, because we fight humans. Convoy doesn't have anything. Phantom. It's on a pilgrimage? Alright, whatever. Um, what do you have? Ruminator as well, that's fine. The Yips! We gotta get rid of the Yips. Cool. Um, I'll do a bit of like finagling off camera to figure out who I can upgrade and who I can't. As well as, you know. Actually, why don't I check this out? Can we upgrade, like, the blacksmith or anything like that? I don't think so. How about the guild? Yeah, we can bring the training regiment all the way down. Some may fall. Sweet. But their knowledge lives on. So it should cost, like, friggin' nothing. Which is awesome. And how many busts do I need for the... Oh, nice. So all I need is crests. Cool. Alright, cool. So next time we come back... Yeah, we'll go on another mission. So yeah, next time we'll, um will be tomorrow. Uh, to, we'll play Darkest Dungeon. Uh, so right now I'm going to transition from Darkest Dungeon to my Fallout 3 Wasteland Princess playthrough. So I hope you guys enjoyed the adventure and stay tuned for some Fallout 3. Hope you guys enjoyed today's uh, Darkest Dungeon. See you in a little bit. See you everybody.